today we're going on a ride with the Street Urchin Scooter Club. It's been a long time since I've been able to be on a ride. I just, my schedule is just crazy here. So, I'm sure they'll be a little surprised to see me because I really didn't tell them that I was going to show up. But, uh, should be fun today. I got a little bit of time. I may have to peel off early, but we'll uh, give it our best shot to just ride around town here. That seems to be the uh, order of the day, what we're doing here. We've met in a couple different places here. We've met over here by these picnic tables and stuff. And then we've also met down around the curve here. So we're going to give it a shot and see if anybody's here yet. I am here early. I wanted to see if, uh, make sure, actually, just make sure that uh, I got to chit-chatted up with some people before we actually went for a ride. I don't see that anybody's here yet, so I want to make the turn and go back around the other way and wait at the entrance. We'll catch you later. There would be Dana. How's it going? I finally made it out. Yeah, good to you. How are you? Oh, I don't know. Yeah. We'll see when I get off. There's Jacob right there coming in. <laughs> He's like, why are you filming me? I don't know if I met him or not. I, there's a skinnier guy. Is he gained some weight? No, he's been that size about, ever since I've known him. Did he take that trip up north with us when we went up to Chicago land? Yes, he did. All right. Yeah, he did. Yep. Yep. This is somebody I haven't seen before. All right, we got another one coming in. That's a Kimco. That's my brand right there. Yeah, that's a 50, I think. That one looks new. Is that a 50 or 125? It says 50 on it. Yeah, yeah. Agility, yep. Oh, brand new. We got the temporary plate and everything. Oh, yeah. Looking good. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I haven't rode out yet. I'm delirious. Yeah. We'll see. Well, here comes <laughs> Becky. Oh, there's trouble. She looks like she's moving a little slow. Yeah. Dang, I ain't feeling much like kicking too much today. Yeah. Uh oh She's going to dish it right back. I got about 6,000 on mine. And that looks way better. Yeah. So, yeah. I don't know. All right, so we got somebody here on a 125. Oh. Good? You're good. You're good. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Look at that. She's looking for a different one. Yeah, really? she's going to sell what she's got for sale. Yeah. And here comes our fearless leader. Look what the cat drug in, right?
little mural here. Just kind of getting a photo opportunity in front of this. We're going to take some photo opportunities today and go out for lunch after that. Look at that. Ceremony, a World War II trainer plane flown by James A. Tooley and passenger Chester H. Fram was flying over Evergreen Memorial Cemetery and Park Hill Cemetery to drop poppies over the ground. On the second pass over Evergreen Memorial Cemetery, the plane crashed into this tree, killing oh. Fram and severely injuring Tooley. It took years for cemetery personnel to determine that this was the tree that they crashed into. 2015, the tree had come down, and cemetery employees felt something more needed to be done with the wood from the tree. Research was done, and chainsaw artist Tom Gill was contracted, and he accepted the challenge. The ribbon-cutting dedication was held November 7, 2015, and members of Thule and Fram families were present and cut the ribbon.
Alright, this is the last portion of the ride for me today. Going to peel off and head home. I've spent my time, so really a lot of fun getting out and meeting some new people and riding around a little bit. So, hope you enjoyed the video. Keep on riding and be safe out there.